Hey Aries, welcome to Good Witch Intuitive Tarot. Thank you guys for liking, sharing, and subscribing. I do appreciate it. This is going to be your um, monthly love reading. Uh, it's for October, but could resonate any time um, that you're guided to see it, obviously. As soon as I started this reading, I used the Whispers of Love deck here. Beautiful deck. And I got the only thing that is real is love shift your focus back to love okay and i also got choose love you always have choice make yours with love okay so apparently spirits wanting you to focus more on love in your life okay and you ended up with three of the romance angels everyone else got i mean you got four everyone else got three you got true love this is the romance of a lifetime you got, this could be the one, you've already met the romantic partner you seek and make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. And also you got getting to know each other. As you reveal your innermost selves to each other, your bond deepens. All right, so apparently spirit is saying that you, um, this could be the one, this is true love, but you're gonna have to get to know each other and make an effort. All right, um, and just to like uh, confirm that we get um, dreams coming true. I, and this reminds me of the Ace of Cups. In um, one of my decks, the Ace of Cups literally looks like that. I think it's the Haunted House Tarot. Um, very similar. Anyway, but um, dreams coming true. And this is the Nine of Cups. It's, it's you know, the getting your wish card, right? wishes hopes dreams right and this is so crazy how much of this you had in your reading look at all these cards of just basically free falling or opening your arms and allowing letting um this these are my free falling cards right here trust and shine and then you've also got spread your wings so you're really being told to open up and allow that heart chakra to just um, and look, the heart chakra came out for you as well. So I'm very, um, I, I definitely think you should be working on your heart chakra. You could do it at night. You could do it, you know, just a few minutes a day will help. You can go on YouTube for that. There's all kinds of like, I like the mantras where uh, you can work on all your chakras. Um, I always feel like if you're going to work on one, why not do them all? You can fine tune your, your chakras in, you know, 10, 15 minutes. They even have ones that are as quick as seven minutes just you know put in there that you want to um balance your chakras in your search and it, this will come up most of you already know this i know but spirit saying flow let it flow shine trust um where did it go spread your wings and flow they're all cards of just allowing getting into a real yin energy and allowing spirit to guide you to this hopes wishes and dreams that also reminds me of the ace of cups like i said I think um, with you needing to work on the heart chakra, it has to do with you've been feeling alone. And you could have been on a journey by yourself. See how she carries the lantern? It reminds me very much of the hermit. The hermit goes on a journey within. That journey's alone. All right, so it's a, it's a very useful time when you're, you know, um, making a lot of progress internally but it also can be like it's a number five card it could be a very challenging time where you feel lost lonely sad abandoned you know even though it's your own journey it's you know one of your own making and it's for a lot of benefit comes when you go on that internal journey it still can feel really alone and it still can affect your heart chakra and again spirit says you know to make the effort and get to know each other and to choose love and the only thing real is love a lot of this feels to me like spirit saying you know again it says um shift your focus back to love you know spirit saying look okay you did the the alone thing you did the internal journey you've done a ton of growth you're ready now now it's time to blossom to open up that heart chakra and just you know allow the love in all right, so here we go in with the, um, so these were the psychic tarot of the heart. These were the angel answers. I mean, I'm sorry, angel, uh, romance angels, and they were the whispers of love. We also used quantum oracle, and we also used the everyday oracle, the Sibylla uh, Italian deck. All right, so let's talk about this. So we've got status quo, back and forth, new supportive connections, which I really do love. 
Uh, they're like peanut butter and jelly, those two. You got behind the mask, which someone's wearing a mask. Um, and then you've got taken steps, sacred temple, and honoring path. Wow, this is such nice energy. Very spiritual. All right, so a lot of this has to do with this internal journey you've been on. But I will say this back and forth with the status quo here, you're torn. Do I stay with the same old, same old every day that I know, which has pretty much been me on my own, doing my own thing, do, you know, not really having to worry about another person? Or do I want to turn around and go back to the for back and forth towards new supportive connection? So you're torn. You're very torn. You're not sure what to do. You have a new supportive connections here. This could be more than one. It could be one or it could be one person in particular. Whatever it is, you're very torn whether to keep things the same or to allow any new people in, anyone in, um, because you really don't want to take the mask off. You're not sure. You really want to, uh, I've, uh, you know, especially after someone's done all this internal work. They don't want anyone to screw it up, right? And that's the truth. You don't want anyone coming in that's not the right person. You don't want to waste your time. But Spirit is saying, look, same old, same old is not really on your journey. When you get, look, you did some, you did a lot of your journey here by going within, getting really grounded, all this growth, all this stuff. All we need you to do is still work on your heart chakra and open it up and allow another human being in. And that's the part of your journey that you're torn about. You're just like, wow, man, I made it this far. And now, you know, if I let someone in, it's a risk. It is a risk, right? It always is. But Spirit says, true love. This is the romance of a lifetime. Um, this could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner uh, you seek. Now, you might not have met them yet, but you're about to. Um, or you met them already, and this is what you're so torn about. Make the effort. Great love is worth the steps you're guided to take and spirit says take the steps right twice you've got taking steps right you've also got getting to know each other as you reveal your innermost selves to each other your bond deepens it's time to open the heart chakra and allow someone to know you and for you to know them it's part of the journey and there's no doubt about that there's no doubt you've got taking the steps sacred temple and the honoring path it's going down the way it's supposed to go down this is the way it's supposed to be and yes you are absolutely right to think twice about it to be careful about it and to only let somebody of high vibration in absolutely and i know that you're feeling like what if they what if what if you know but spirit says, no, this is part of your journey. And we expect you to know who to let in and who to block. You know, pay attention to the red flags. That card did not come out. But I feel it, you know, I feel it here that you should definitely pay attention to the red flags. Make sure that you, when you're choosing the person you're going to open that heart chakra for and allow in, that you're choosing the right person. This is dreams come true. So only the right person is going to be your dream come true only the right person is going to be the one only the right person is going to be the true love only the right person okay and i think you're going to know that because you're going to go together like peanut butter and jelly right this is going to be someone you really gel with but you are going to feel torn like do i let them in do i what do i do what do i do spirit says please let them in allow open up spread your wings trust shine free fall Jesus, take the wheel. Allow the universe to take you to where you need to be. Go with the flow, okay? Definitely, spirit wants you to receive. They want you to be in a yin energy and receive. At the same time, you're making the effort to allow this person into your heart. Um, it's, it's really special. They want you to get to know a person. Listen, this... This might, the first one might not be the one. You're going to know when the right one arrives. You're going to know because you're going to get along like this. All right. And spirit wants you to drop the mask. Let, let them see the real you. You know, only accept people in who aren't wearing a mask. This is all part of your journey. Okay. And as we come down to the Italian cards, the Sibylas, um, 
we have someone here who is on a mission it has something to do with we have la amica here so this could be a female friend you could be the female friend someone's on a mission they have a lot of hope for this whatever it is whether it's you or them someone is waiting for some kind of information they're like on the lookout waiting patiently for the ships to come in they want to hear something they want information they want to know something and what is it they want to know they want to know about love um and they want to have a conversation and also i asked about who this is that's on a mission because i wanted to know if it was a feminine or a masculine and still i mean it could be either or but we got someone here who's waiting patiently really studying the situation and dreaming about all the things they want to have with this person really nice okay so one person involved in all this if not both really wants this and i feel like you are going to have to expect well if you really want this you're going to have to open up i can see that everywhere it's time to open the heart chakra it's time to balance the heart chakra like i said there's tons of stuff on youtube to help you um do just that and you can work on that every day for the next you know however long it takes until you are ready to allow this person in or allow, you know allow yourself to open up and, and be yourself around another person shift your focus back to love that was the first card that came out the only thing that's real is love shift your focus back to love and it's the other one was choose love you always have a choice make yours with love this is a beautiful reading if you are willing to really open up and it's open up open up open up open up go with the flow open up the heart chakra this is going to lead to dreams come true it really is i think that as soon as you stop going back and forth about it and make a decision that decision should be choose love remember um you're going to be right on the path you need to be on you've already been doing a lot of internal work and spirit says okay we don't want you stuck in the fives this is a place people get stuck it's a great time to do work on self um it it, it involves uncomfortable change and sometimes people get really stuck here some people get stuck in fives i think for years some of them get stuck for months sometimes weeks sometimes days but some people get stuck for years and years and years so spirit says it's time for you to flow instead of being stuck feeling alone they want you to flow and open up open it all up this is expanding your heart chakra and allowing this person in guys let me know about this how this resonated with you really nice reading it just shows that you have every opportunity to have some real love in your life you've ex you've been doing some internal work and now it's time to release that and go with the flow and free fall jesus take the wheel so to speak right whatever you want to call it allowing yourself to be guided by whoever you believe in to where you need to be and who you need to be in it with let's get you a couple of angel cards guys don't forget to hit the thumbs up i really do appreciate it you hit liking the video it's so important for all of your favorite channels that you hit that like so that these people can continue doing what they do for you guys it's um we are graded on that all right so thank you guys so much let me get you a couple of angel cards angels what do we need to know here it's a lot but okay oh yeah it's four that's okay well all right yeah having that faith to dive in again how many cards are saying please just go with it allow it go with the flow have faith dive in over and over again patience it's all about divine timing and it is time you've done the work it's time it's true love this could be the one make the effort get to know this person all those love cards are saying it's time and get excited about it spirit says get the, that heart chakra balanced and open it up and truth whatever this is there is a truth between the two of you i do feel like you're, this is going to be a really special bond just like these two people peanut butter and jelly okay guys let me know how this resonated with you if it resonated with you um and let me know if this is what you've been doing working on self and now it's time to come out of that shell and let someone in please like share subscribe i very much appreciate it have a great month and don't forget to check out the weeklies are out the dailies are out the weekend is out check them all out all the love readings should be out by now all right guys have a good one i'll talk to you soon bye